Okay, now back up a little bit. There we go. Anna, what's going on? Why did we stop? Hey, listen, I know we're going back to the castle, but we have to bring some gifts along. Uh, what kind of gifts in the middle of nowhere? I don't know, something everybody can enjoy and play with. Oh, that's a tough one. Let's see. Bruni? Oh, there you are, my sweet Bruni. Do you have any ideas? Oh, that's a perfect idea. Caboodle fans, welcome back to Toy Caboodle. Bruni's perfect idea is to make Bruni slime. If you don't know who Bruni is, he's Elsa's salamander sidekick. And he's so adorable. He is grayish blue, he has blue eyes, and I can't wait to see him in the movie. So today, we are gonna be making some Bruni themed slime. So you might be wondering, is this what Bruni looks like? Just one color? Well, we went online. Here's a little clip art of him. Looks like he's white. Here's another image of him. It looks like he's got some blue and purple on the very top of him and some black specks on his feet. So we need to pick a slime that's gonna be purple and blue, some snowflakes because Bruni loves eating snowflakes. Okay, here are the colors that we have to work with. Hmm, I'm really feeling this light purple, plus it has some glitter in it. Oh, it's the glow in the dark one, perfect. And then I'm gonna use this blue glittery one. This one's gonna look fabulous. And then of course we need the Elmer's Magical Liquid to make our slime. We've got our frozen two bowl we're gonna use to make our slime. Hi, Olaf. I kinda wish there was a little Bruni in there. So we're gonna make these one at a time. We're gonna start with this blue. Empty the whole entire bottle in here. All right, there we go. Look at how sparkly that is. Shake, shake. Now we're gonna take our magical liquid and in the instructions it says to add a fourth cup of this. Guess what we're gonna do? We're just gonna eyeball it. So what you do is you wanna add a little bit at a time. Don't add all of the one fourth cup in here. All right, some more. And you wanna just keep on mixing it until it forms into a slime. Look, it's already forming. It's so ooey gooey. All right, let's add a little bit more in. Really mix that up. Okay, once it doesn't stick to the bowl, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab it and we are gonna start playing with it with our fingers stretching it, pulling it. Here is our beautiful blue slime. So since Bruni loves eating snow, guess what? We're gonna add some snowflake confetti. We're gonna take our giant slime and I'm gonna go ahead and sprinkle this with a bunch of snowflakes. All right, go ahead and press those in and mix them together. Okay, this looks like an Elsa slime. I'm so happy how it turned out. All right, we're gonna put this slime to the side because now I'm gonna take this glow-in-the-dark purple one and we're gonna make slime out of this one too. Whoa, what an awesome color. Here we go. Now that we've dumped that out, we're gonna grab our Elmer's Magical Liquid and we're gonna pour this a little bit at a time and start mixing it together. Ooh, doesn't that look cool? This is what it looks like so far, so stretchy. Let's keep adding and mixing. Let's go ahead and mix this up with our hand. It's so ooey gooey, it feels kind of like brains. All right, little fans, here is our purple slime. I really like the color of this, but we need to add some mix-ins to it. We're gonna use these foam beads. What a perfect color, it's purple. It's gonna match perfectly. Then I found this really awesome confetti glitter. Kind of looks like ice. And then I'm gonna add these really pretty pink hearts. We're gonna start with these heart confetti. Whoa. Okay, since we really love Bruni, we're gonna add these in here. And also, of course, confetti glitter that looks like ice. We're gonna go ahead and sprinkle that on. And then our foam beads. This is gonna have a lot of texture. All right, let's just press this down. I'm just gonna fold this over because it's not sticking. Here we go. Ah, Bruni, it feels so good already. Now I'm gonna grab the whole entire thing and we are gonna start mixing this together. Let's see how awesome and fabulous it's gonna look. This is our second slime. Look at how awesome those foam beads look and those hearts. I really like the two colors and it's so stretchy. I love it. So now we're gonna take this purple slime 
and this blue slime, and we are gonna add the two together to make it into a bruni slime. Okay, this one has tons of snowflakes. It's turquoise. This one is purple with the foam beads. Okay, here we go. We're just gonna twist it together and combine the two colors. How pretty. And guess who we're gonna add? We're gonna add the famous Bruni to this. What do you all think? Comment down below, does this slime fit Bruni? I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and stay sweet.